Hey guys, this is Kirob speaking, and today we're back in Pro Cycling Manager 2019 with Federico Chivaldori. And uh, we are uh, in our simulated season number four. And just need one more monument to sign off on the whole thing, on the whole Let's Play. It was an all monument challenge after all, and we have everything but the uh, Lombardia. And uh, that is because we simply didn't have it on our race calendar. I would think that. Um, the Lombardia would uh, probably be the second easiest of the monuments for Enrico to get. And we have all the others already. So, it's out of the way. We shall see how that goes. But first, um, we are going to race some hand-picked races. This one, for instance. Uh, not the next one. That is, that is a time trial. We don't care. Um, so this one, for instance, just because I want to see how that cobble sector there towards the end looks like. And then, ah, we don't care about this one. Um, the Tour de France is going to be raced. That will be quite interesting. Uh, it, does it have a cobble stage, a proper one? Not not a fake one like uh, like this first one. It has a cobble sector in there. Uh, I don't think so. Probably not here in the second week or third, the third week. Final, final day. Paris-Roubaix. <laughs> that would be cruel. Uh, Yes. So, uh, we are going to take on this stage only and then head over to the Tour de France. Now, I just need to force myself to actually click the correct button. 3D race it is. And a zero race day condition. All right. Um, so, I've no hopes in winning this stage or anything. It's just purely out of curiosity what it looks like, what they have modeled there. And we do have some helpers. The junkie is a helper? That sounds good. All right. Well, we do have the green jersey right now. Um, and... Whoa. Yeah, yeah, that's the points jersey. Right. This is the climbers jersey. And third in that. And 18th down there. Ugh, no. Um, we are facing the likes of Egan Bernal and, and company. So that thing won't be possible to get up first. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. They are racing hard up this climb. Holy shit. Uh, could you please take a uh, position up front there again? Maybe something else happened. Maybe we got spooled to the back. But uh, yeah, that was scary for a moment. Now we're slowly moving up this first category climb. They have uh, come down slightly. Uh, it's no longer really pushing the envelope too much. And this is not the steepest of climbs. It's very steppy. And uh, they're not going hard in those in-between sectors. They, really are moving. they have raced this stage so damn hard already. Everyone is down on a, uh, on the stamina. Like crazy. I don't know if um, anyone will have what it takes to power through here full, like on 85 or something. And there is a sprint rating coming up. Uh, let me just... Uh, Move out of here for for a sec. I do want to grab. Oh no, they are going. Okay, no, I, I'm not going to grab anything. I'm just going to stay here. Well, we are almost there. This is a very intimidating climb. 14 kilometers. I think we can go no more than 70 up this beast. Um, well, let's see what they are doing. Let's first get more to the front. So much wind too. Okay, so far, pace quite low. I think that will stay like this for a little while at least. And let's check some of the usual suspects. Whoa, yeah, okay. They still have plenty in them. 10%. Oh, now they are reacting. Uh, that is and not the favorites going, though. Yeah, yeah, okay, you could, could say up. that they kind of are. Uh, nine kilometers left. I do have plenty of resistance left, but overall very low pace, so probably an 80 climb? Let's see. The junkie can pull me for a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Let, let them go. Let them star, star rocket ship their, their heart rates and see what happens to them. And the junkie is just doing a beautiful job pulling. And ah, oh, there they are back just wasted lots of energy. They have, not me. Oh no, the junkie is empty. And so is Alaphilippe. There's no more help for the Chivaldori. 
Oh, there we go. Yay. Okay, five kilometers worth of cobbles. Um, let's activate our bar right now. It's a one star, so it doesn't really do anything, does it? 5.5 uh, .5 kilometers. I think we need to lower our efforts still. And these guys are way too low on their bar. Oh, Bernal is... What is he doing? Is he struggling? No, he's not really struggling, is he? Uh, oh, now we have our bar active. Should we try to poke? I don't think so. I don't think so. That was suicide. These other guys have way too much resources left. Oh, now we got away. They have to close the gap. There comes Egan Bernal. Ah, Roglic is going. Do I want to follow? Uh, he has less resistance than I do. I could start going 85 now. Let's see. Just just rail him in slowly but surely. Yeah, so far so good. Oh, Michelana is up front. Okay, we have more resistance than him. That should be fine. He is dead. So the only one as a contender right now is Roglic. But Roglic is looking mighty fine still. But has less red bar than we have. Michelana is still staying. Still staying close. Uh, can we... Can I follow him? No, no, I can't. No, I can't. He... Is getting lower, but... Why can't I follow him? Can I follow him now? Yeah, it looks like it. Alright, Roglic is the one to follow. 1.6 kilometers left. No one else can really contest this. Let's see. We do, uh, of course, have a better sprint than... <laughs> Than both of them, so we should easily be able to win this. Uh, how about do that now? Because he's empty. He's kind of empty. We can get some more time on them by just attacking. So let's do this. And there, the and there we are. Final, uh, final sprint is on, and we are going to get thick legs, but it flattens out enough so that it doesn't really matter, does it? Holy shit, <laughs> 27 seconds on the final kilometer. Ah, uh, no, no, there he comes. Yeah, yeah. Well done, well done, Enrico. So, we did win it after all, but just being smart or something. That was an impressive result, and that should catapult us up in the standings as well. Let's see what it does. Chevaldori rocket! Yeah, 21 seconds on Primoz. Uh, we are third right now. There's a time trial to come, where he's going to nuke us from orbit. Oh! Ultimate Pro Cyclist? What? What? Achievement unlocked. Ultimate Pro Cyclist. I don't know what that means. Oh, let me check. Ah, okay. Level up. Level 36. Uh, is that the final level? I don't think so. No. Next one. Why, why does it say Ultimate Pro Pro cyclist, if that is the second to last level, that doesn't make any sense. And there we have uh, the final stage of this tour. And quick simulate, because uh, we we can't be bothered. Uh, and let's see, what do you get? Massive time disadvantage. Come on, no, 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 no. Just lost. Uh, how how did Alaphilippe win this one? Well, okay, he's he's pretty good, but not a mountain rider. Why can he win this one and not me? Mm. Okay, uh, that means we're still in third. Haven't lost anything. We're still leading in the points. We... Oh, we did get the mountain jersey too. And the under 25 as well. That is a good result then. <laughs> okay, well, this one... This one isn't really relevant. Uh, Italian... Inter uh, Italian... Not international. National uh, time trial championship. So, quick simulate that one. Uh, how high up do we come? Top 10? Let's see. Uh, no, that was very generous. Top 20. Oh, it looks like our fitness peak is aligning perfectly with the Tour de France. That is really neat. And we can trigger it quite, quite early. Manually, if we wanted to. Can't do that yet, but there's still a few days to go. And national championships, road championships, and we are... Whoa. Who are you? Gianni Moscon. Uh, yeah, okay. 
you do have a good shot at this, actually. This is this is your profile as well as mine, uh, but more mine more so because of the game mechanics, because I have a higher mountain stat and can chill on these climbs. So who takes it? Him or me? Let's see. Oh, oh yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, of course. Of course, game. <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. <laughs> okay, let's space bar this thing. We are now on the fifth. I need to activate my fitness peak manually. Because this one is going to last 28 days, isn't it? Uh, I think that is what it says here. Uh, there we go, 28 days. Also, the Tour de France is 24 days long, isn't it? Because we have... Uh, 24? 23. We have two rest days and 21 stages. So, that, that pans out just fine, doesn't it? 99% uh, fitness right now. Trigger the fitness peak. Then, for tomorrow, we will have it. Because this is bugged. There we go. Race day condition. Plus two bias. Excellent. So, who's racing with me? Uh, Alaphilippe is here. Ah. Zemmeling is the other one which we wanted to have along. Well, our main helper is not here. Ah, the junkie is here, though. But he's more like uh, someone who's racing for stage wins and hill 85 did he have a friggin level up again holy shit he's strong so no more simulation the tour de france is what we are going to do as our second to last race that we are not simulating and that's a lot of lot of racing uh, that will be how many how many will that be for like five episodes, roughly, to finish this off then. A very short fourth season, but this Let's Play has been quite long already. It's a difficult race with oh man, this section. game is so damn slow to load, especially these stages. Oh, wow, this is chugging as fuck. Okay, uh, so, spent ten minutes loading this shit and it only crashed once. But we do have a nice race day condition for this first stage of the Tour de France. And we shall have a look at the profile. Oh, these are cobble climbs, aren't they? And then a uh, slightly uphill finish. Maybe we can do a little punching there. Also, what will be pretty good is racing a grand tour with actual competent teammates. That is fantastic. Ooh, okay. Well, these are proper climbs. Uh, Capelmur. Hello there, good sir. A four-star sector. I think this is exactly where I'm going to uh, make sure that things are exploding a bit. So, perfect lead out. Perfect lead out. There we go. Uh, you don't really have to hang in there that much. Let me let Enrico do his thing. Oh, can can anyone follow? Oh, he has 72 in cobbles. He will be uh, quite, quite challenged. Oh, yes. <laughs> He's using all his red. All right. Interesting, interesting. That should really splinter the penalty hard. Oh, no, they can't hang on. And we're tackling the boars back as well. And that's still a little ways off. Yeah, we're just rolling along at 60. It's fine. Uh, let's grab some water while we can. And there it is. And there's the boars back. Let's go 80. And here we have it. All right. Uh, we don't get any points for this now. No, not, not even close. All right. All done. My work here is done. We have splintered the peloton. We have caused some havoc. And maybe we can make use of that later in this stage. A rider is down. Hey, could I please get back a helper? That would be mighty fine, you guys. Oh, okay. That is not an insignificant cobble sector coming up. 1.8 kilometers long, 3 star. And there it starts. And see, we're headed in there Somehow perfectly. The yes. Narrow, so it's to be well to oh, avoid oh, we've ripped the, the peloton again. Sorry, guys. 
Now they have accelerated for the final few kilometers. Uh, 26 to go. And let's have a look here. Nothing too spectacular in the, in the climbs department. Um, but the finish line is pretty non-shallow. So uh, maybe the sprint is way shorter than usual. Let's see if we can make use of that. Okay, I think I need to pop the uh, my gel right now. 5.6 kilometers out. And that is because most of the finishing stretches here are down here. And I don't want to trigger it too late. Also, I have no helper here. Oh, well, I do have one helper, but I can't influence him at all. So that is unfortunate. Um, he's locked in because of my... Oh, well, it's not, not my trick, but the trick that I like to use. Um, yeah, just put him on next move automatic and then they can't change it for some reason. It's a bug. It's a bug. And now the final sprint is drawing near. Mm, let's grab a good wheel. Can we follow? No, we can't follow him. We're following him instead. Uh, you are way, way enough of a sprinter to uh, pique my interest here. Let's follow him instead. Yeah, 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 yeah. that's good. Uh, but you guys are going way too hard already. Way too hard already. Way too hard already. Um, one kilometer left to go. And I, I just can't sprint that long. That, that is way too, too much. Sprint. Sprint, sprint, sprint. Oh, out of the way. Out of the way, Enrico's coming through. Oh, that's a pretty good performance. Third? I think it's third. Yes. Awesome. Yeah, not too bad. 20 points for this. Um, as we are... Oh, finishing the top 15 of the overall general classification. I think that means that we will see a few good number of points we gain. Maybe we can get a level up. I think we will get a level up during this tour. Like if we get a decent number of points every time, like 15 or so, with 20 stages, that's 300. So, uh, yeah. And we don't need 300 for the final level up. So I think we are going to race the final race of this Let's Play at maximum level. That sounds good to me. Sign me up! Oh, yes, we will definitely do that, because we also have two... three more month ticks? And that's 150 experience right there. 156 even. I believe this is a team time trial, isn't it? Uh, sure as hell looks like one. Let's see, who are the favorites? Uh, yes. Okay. And we are among the favorites. Despite me being there. Which is <laughs> good news. So, um, for once, the team time trial might actually not be that bad. Oh, if every single stage takes that damn long to load, oh, this is going to take a while. Oh yes, okay, so, we are on the start line, not quite, 20 more teams to go. And there we are, okay, Enrico, what can we do with you? You need to go 100% of course, but for how long, 10 seconds? Ooh, those race day conditions don't look too good apart from Jakobsen. Who gets a plus 12 in prologue? <laughs> That's not helping today. But uh, it's good to see that he is at least getting a 68 in time trial. Uh, ooh, he's good. And now our pick for Zemling should be pretty decent. Uh, apart from your race day condition, man. That is under uh, un underwhelming. So from the looks of it, we are not even the worst rider in here. Uh, that is uh, disappointing. But uh, that also means... Oh, wow. Yeah, of course, we have the junkie as well. Um, I should do eh, probably about 12 seconds and, of course, max. Now, not much I can do here, apart from uh, try to to push the team hard. And... Ooh, ooh, oh, 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 I hope I'm... No, I'm not going to get to the front once more, because that would be... Oh! Well... That didn't go too well. Holy shit, why... Why did you drop off? Everyone is empty, but I mean, come on. And there we go. That is quite a time penalty we got there. Um, yeah, not great. So where is Enrico? All the way down here somewhere? No, no, he isn't. There he is. One minute ten. 
And my team got 20 something seconds. Hmm. Yeah. I didn't quite anticipate that I would be running out of resistance. I was the only rider who did. Ouch. Well, that, that makes it a little harder. We need to grab some time somewhere else. How about on this stage, then? <laughs> That's uh, pretty much perfect for us. Oh, wow, and our, the whole team is basically the favorite. Cool. Let's race it. Okay, perfect stage for us. Let's see what we can do. Plus, whoa, okay, we, we will be able to do something. <laughs> That's for sure. Uh, yeah. That is a rough, rough profile there towards the end. I think there will only be a little group left at the last third category climb. Then we could easily attack on the second to last climb, like the one before the finish. Yeah, okay. Another thing that is in our favor is, of course, that this is a very long stage and has some, uh, some undulation here and there. Look at this little sector here in the middle. That is not that easy. Very much up and down. And should make it such that we are saving some energy before we get into those final hills. And also, they are still chasing the SKPs. That is great news. Because that means they are racing really hard. And that means our stamina comes to bear towards the... Already towards the middle of the stage. Uh, what the fuck? Why do I all of a sudden have Alaphilippe as my helper? <laughs> That, that is a nice surprise, I guess. We shall see if that remains to be true. I, I'll just place him up front at 85, hold position. We uh, might need him in a little while then. Oh yeah, he's gone already, uh, as expected. Some brain cancer issues here. Oh, by the way, we have 82 mountain today. <laughs> oh, that's... Yeah, that is competitive. Oh, okay, the flow of the pal- Oh, fucking hell, the flow of the peloton just uh, came like a tidal wave crashing on top of me there. And we are no longer at the front. Uh, there is a point to grab here. So, is that what they're racing for? No, they just want to hold up a decent pace. Can't fault them for that. Oh, uh, I hope we still can get some water. Uh, I did send my helper back to finally grab some because no one else would. Oh, yeah, and there's the climb. Fortunately, it's just my teammates doing the work. Yeah, yeah, come on, come on. Push, push, push. Oh, shit. Yes, they are pushing. Uh, let's go 95. And give me some water. Yes, perfect. Okay, now I'm fine. Now we can go from here. I think they are trying to rip apart the peloton. Holy fuck, that was... Uh, it's quite a pace, 95 limited. <laughs> here we go. Oh, wow. Yes, they have uh, just reduced the peloton to smithereens. Lutsenko is going? Is he going for the points or something? They might. Uh, do I want to contest that? Uh, let's see. He's basically empty, so I could. If I go 99, then I should be able to... Yes, yes I was. Uh, just lower down to 75 again. Grab the points. Smile. And show the middle finger to Lusenko. Alright, tactics. My plan is to just hang with the fast ones in the next climb. The proper punches, like the junkie. That should be a good wheel to have, because he seems to be very, very good today. Uh, yeah, and then, in the next little climbs, try an, a surprise attack. If I can surprise my teammates. And here, let me get a little for further forward. This is so steep. I uh, probably need to go 90. Just to hang in there a little bit. Oh, wow, they are going hard. 95 it is. It's just a 500 meter climb, so that should be enough. Yeah, that's spot on. Perfect. All right, we're hanging with the fastest. That's good, in case it rips. And take position. Uh, getting away won't be easy, that's for sure. 22, 28 riders in this group. 
And he's just doing so much crazy work up front. <laughs> he's pulling everyone. Lusenko is on uh, on pulling duty for uh, for Astana. Okay, so I do need my bar active in the next climbs. And not so much in the finishing stretches. So let's activate it here. And this is going a little slow. Although I do want to be placing my attack from uh, slightly further behind. Uh, Kwiatkowski now pulling. Alright. Uh, can you please get a bit further forward? That would be very kind of you. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, now we have... Oh, we have our bar already. Uh, I think I might want to try something here then. Attack! Come on! Whoop! <laughs> and off you go! Off you go! Whoa! Rocket ship into this climb! Yes! Yes, 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 yes! Go, go, go! And it's flattening out. We have 20 seconds. Very, very sharp edge there. And and downhill. Aerodynamic position. Not activate that one yet. As soon as we are down here in the valley, though. So I can activate it now. Um, just go all out. Not, maybe not 99, but like 90. And then we only have this final little hill to contest with. 24 seconds, that should be enough. And it should give my teammates behind me a perfect reason to not be doing any work and have their opponents uh, empty when it comes to actually pulling up here. And we just sprint. There we go. Come on, come on, sprint, sprint, sprint. It still a de was a decent pace until we died. And do we get any time? Oh, they are so close. So close, but I think we do get some time. Yes. Alaphilippe, come on. Come on, Alaphilippe. Third for Alaphilippe. Yes. No, Matthews. Michael Matthews gives... Ah, damn it. Ah, that was a poor performance by the junkie. And that is our first Tour de France win. A very, very strong showing by Enrico here. Yeah, that makes up for some of the uh, mistake we had in the time trial. 15 seconds on his worst competitors. And that means that we are second in the green. And, mm, okay, fourth in the mountain. Uh, but now leading in front of Egan Bernal. Oh, we're leading in front of him. Okay, now oh, that's cool. Uh, yeah, the under 25s, pretty good. And we moved up to ninth place. So we're back in the top 10. That should give us a decent amount of score for each stage continuing here. That's 24 points right here. Very good. And stage number four also looks interesting, but mm, this climb is slightly too far away from the finish, despite all the downhill that is coming with it. Um, too long for a solo attack, unless we have a plus five or something stupid like that. So, no, not really seeing much of a chance here. Anyway, that is for another episode. I hope you enjoyed, and see you guys next time. <laughs>